I'm not a talking pig! Oh, there you are, my silly little man. Come in. Lunch is ready. Bring it on! Excuse me. Pardon me? <laughs> Could someone please tell me where I am? And also, who I am? Oh, he's seen us. He'll tell others. We'll all be sold on the internet. Freddy, no! <gasps> Your arms are too weak. Let Bessie do it. Yeah! Wait, 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 wait! Uh, how's it going there, little guy? You seem like a wise and kindly soul. Can you tell me where I am? Suh, wait! He's got amnesia! That's Latin for the best thing that ever could have happened to us! Otis, what are you talking about? Don't you see? He doesn't remember he's a jerk, which means he'll never bother us again. I excuse me, are you people all talking animals? No, no, we're a theater troupe in costume for our brand new show, Fur Town, appearing at a small town theater near you. Well, it's getting late and we've had a good talk. It's time to get you home. Oh! Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! Did I hear someone at the door? No, no, uh, what door? We don't have any doors. Oh, don't you be such a little silly willy billy tilly billy. Good afternoon, ma'am. The nice theater troupe man said I'm your nephew. Sweetums, why are you outside when you are standing right next to me? Ah! Oh! Ah! Ah! Auntie Nora, uh, he, he's clearly an imposter. He's probably one of those talking animals from next door in disguise. Yes, that's the only explanation. He's not even wearing proper clothes. Get out of here, you camel or whatever you are. Scoot, or I'll call the police. Get out! Okay, this time he's gotta be toast. <laughs> what? What happened? Why are you all looking at me? You stupid stinkies! Uh -oh. What am I doing on this stupid farm? Out of my way! Stupid stinkies! Staring like... Yeah! I'm back! Where's my stupid lunch? Oh! It's the talking camel! Who are you? And what are you doing with my stuff? Give it back! No, it's my stuff! No way! No, oh, it's my stuff! Let's go it's my stuff! Yes. I'm her real nephew! I'm her real nephew! Oh dear, which one is my Eugenie Weenie? I am, and I'll prove it! Ah. Oh yeah? Bad guy, you stupid phony! You're the stupid phony! Huh! I'm having enough! Yeah. Hey! What's going on in here? Yeah. Uncle Nathan! Look out! Huh? You're the imposter! My Eugene would never risk his life to save that lump! But Auntie, I... But, 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 ah! Bye, stupid kid who looks like me. Oh! <laughs> go, 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 go! Is that all you need? Yeah, I think we're good. <coughs> oh, Pip, buddy, thank goodness I was finally able to decode your complicated text message. You mean Abby read it to you? Pretty much. <sighs> He's waking up! You've got to get out of here! Yeah, scary snake! It's okay, he's cool. Oh, if this is another prank, I'm really gonna lose it. Good afternoon. My son has something he'd like to say. Uh, yes, your face smells. Try again. I'm sorry I made you think your house was in outer space, Mrs. Beatty. You did it. Oh, what a relief. This is fun oh. now. I thought it was those talking animals that drive me mad. <laughs> Would you like to come in for some vitamin crackers and frogurt? No. He would love that. Oh, he is so adorable. You know, I have a nephew about your age. We should arrange a play date. Rather die. He would love that. My spirited boy loves to play. Tell me about it. Little Eugene is exactly the same way. May I touch him? I really wish you wouldn't. Please. Oh, what chubby little cheeks. Oh, Definitely squishy. invading personal space. Like a jelly peach. Or like very a unclean. piece of marzipan. I can't take any more of this! Ah! I'm sorry. He didn't have his nap yet. Oh, I hear you, girlfriend. Oh, what a lovely family. Smell like a stable, but nice. Hey, Otis. 
Are you sure it's safe playing Dungeons and Barn Animals out in the open like this? Of course it's safe. The farmer's napping and only a halfwit would drop by to visit a bunch of barn animals. I'm gonna visit the barn animals because that's what I do. I'm gonna visit the barn animals, so hoodly hoodly who? My giant big boy brain makes me their leader. Oh, time for a potty break. the power of Glamisil, the plunger which has been reforged! Never! Well, hi -ya! You were talking! Uh, no, we weren't. Yes, you were. I saw you. You're talking barnyard animals. No, I'm uh, Conan, a bold barbarian hero, and these are some elves and stuff. <laughs> As if... This is a barnyard! No, no, it's not. It's, uh, the magical land of Barnia! Say what? Will you please work with me? See? That's the mystical poo shack that transported you! But isn't that the farmer's house? No, that's the, um... Uh, the castle of the choking! Yes, well, what the tiny rat wizard said. We're dead. You'd have to be stupid and nuts to believe that story. I completely believe that story! He went into the farmer's house! We can't go in there! The farmer will see us! Huh? They stopped outside the castle. They must fear the power of the Troll King. <laughs> Nothing like a nice hot shower after my nap. Ah! Oh, mighty Troll King, allow me to serve you well by teaching me your stupid ways. Uh, I don't know what you're saying. Oh, he's powerless without his mystical warlock gems. You need counseling. I'm taking over this kingdom. Think fast, Troll. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh good gracious. Great. We're never gonna get him off the barnyard. He thinks it's a magical fantasy land. Fix right. We shouldn't have been playing around in the open like that. Oh, guys, would you relax? Look, the farmer probably stuck a juice box in the little freak's face and threw him in front of the TV. He's probably forgotten all about Barnia by now. Bow down to your new Dark Lord, Maldork. Guys, I think we should play along. I really do. I play along? What? Why? Because as long as we stay in character, he won't know we're just a bunch of talking animals. Bow down, I said. Oh, yes, right. you say, sir. Now dance. Ha <laughs> ha ha! I'm bored. I know. I'll use my new powers to make this place my evil fortress. Later, stupid magical stinkies. He's wrecking the place. I'm going in there. Right behind you. No! It's okay, Otis. The farmer's in the basement. He won't see us. Yeah, but if you kick his butt, he'll just keep coming back like a bad case of pink eye. So what's your plan? We get him to go back through the outhouse. Then destroy it so he thinks his portal to Barney is gone. Come to Papa. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for flying Air Outhouse. Oh, how are my little daffodils? You're so good to your mama. Yes, you are. Not like those begonias. That's right, you filthy little beast. Uh, my portal to Barnia. It's ruined. Oh, he's delirious. Come inside. They'll make you some chai tea and a splint for your spine. Oh, but I was a dark and powerful wizard. Bow before me. There, Bow, there. I say. That's it. <laughs> Let it out. Let it out. My fate's... Ooh, tough break, toots. Yeah, better stick to karaoke. <gasps> Get those talking bird animals. Stop him! <laughs> if... I don't got it, then I'll make sure those talking barn animals don't got it either. Hey, you're a funny looking fella, ain't you? What's up with that? Son, you may be pink and funny looking, but you just made me believe a magic. Come on, let's have some punch. Can I help you, Mr. Pig and Cow in human costume thinking no one notices? 
Um, I'll just have the uh, lettuce cups. Security! Hurry! Do something! Can't you see their animals? They put lettuce on their heads. They're animals, I swear! Let go! I would seriously consider hiring another craft service person. Expose those animals if it's the last thing I do. The cake Cheating, huh? I might have suspected. And I like elves. <gasps> Boston! What the? It's a scam! <laughs> They're making a mockery of this show, which embodies all that's great about us as a species. Lady? Your vigilance has saved this show and made you a national hero. Oh, and that's not all. They're also talking barn animals. They live next door to me and have wild ritualistic hoedowns all night long. You had me and you lost me. Security! That one's a cow and he's a pig. I'm not crazy. Woo! Chicken activist, run in varying directions! Bigfoot? Bigfoot? Huh? Local police don't know! To the woods! <laughs> if I could capture Bigfoot, I'd be a hero instead of the town kookaburra. It's Bigfoot! Quick, constable, take him down! He's mauling that poor cow, I can't get a beat on him! Oh, give me that! Hey! This is where I go from goofy town to Heroville! Eat Tranquilizer, Bigfoot! Mm -hmm. oh, just... No! <gasps> Bigfoot! I can't believe it! Bigfoot took that dart from me! And all this time, I thought he was out to get us. We gotta get him out of here, come on! I should have figured the talking barn animals were in on it with him. I found Bigfoot! So chew on that, everybody! You thought I was crazy! <laughs> Bigfoot! Oh, you're mine, buddy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Who's your daddy? Who's your daddy now, Bigfoot, huh? Wait a minute, this isn't Bigfoot, this is a cow dressed up to look like Bigfoot! A shocking development! Someone has pasted fur on a cow to give him the appearance of Bigfoot! But who would post such a cheap stunt just to get on TV? What? No! The cow's in league with him! He can tell you where Bigfoot is! You're under arrest for Bigfoot fraud! No! There's no need for fear. Cowman is somewhat near. That's your cowman. He's a hero. Nathan, it's those animals from next door pretending to be superheroes again. Oh, just pretend you're deaf. You don't fool me, cowman. You're that rude cow from next door. Mr. Hamtastic. I'm on it. Ah. <laughs> cowman took my corn kernel. But I will track him down, and by all that is damp and pasty, I will have my vengeance! I can help you, Professor. I know where Cowman lives. <gasps> you do? You must take me there, my good man. Woman! Whatever. When do we get to Cowman's lair? Pretty soon, and then you'll get the corn kernel, and I'll get to expose Cowman as a talking barnyard animal! You are wacky. I like that in a hapless pawn. Well, let me know when we get there. Well, where are we? This is just some stupid farm. I told you, Cowman is a real cow. They're all real animals. Okay, thanks for slowing me down. Now get out. It's them. It's his little pals, but no Cowman. Oh, <gasps> it is the Justice Brood. You were right. Question. You're all coming with me. This Mrs. Beanie, run away! And I'll reveal to the world that you're nothing but a talking bird. Animal. Now all we have to do is figure a way out of this den of evil. Good thing I brought these spare costumes in case we're spotted. But wait! You said I could unmask him! Did I? I don't recall. Well, off to the fair! This is Beatty. You saved Cowman's life. Why? I can't let him take out his broken heart on those innocent people. Oh, why? Oh, why was I cursed with these good looks? You won't regret this! 
Cowman away! Moo! But I'm still going to unmask you! Riddle me this, Saturn Avenger! What walks and talks like a superhero, but is really a cow? Don't you walk away. I'm on to you! I bet this X is the entrance to your hidden cow headquarters! 